All right, if we can avoid not getting hit by this car, uh, we'll get started on the video of the Five Points area. I am on Agriculture Drive getting ready to do a video of the University Drive area of Five Points. So right now is Agriculture Drive, which is pretty much the southeast border of the Five Points area of Athens. And Agriculture is going to run right into the south part of UGA's main campus. And to the other side here, we're on University, it runs towards Millage Avenue. It represents a very popular part of the Five Points area of town. I'm just now turning on the University and you can see we've now gone into a very residential area. Some homes here actually under construction, which has been very popular over the last three or four years in this area of town. Um, on University is probably the closest street in the Five Points area that's right on top of UGA's main campus. So Five Points as a whole is very close to UGA, uh, very central in town for Athens, but this part of Five Points, the University Drive area, is by far the uh, the closest. It can, you can walk right onto campus, you're behind the baseball field, um, which is popular, close to Stegman Coliseum for the basketball games and gym dog meets. You're also very walkable to Barrow Elementary, which we will drive by towards the end of the video. So we're heading towards Millage Avenue, and to our left and right, there's streets like Morton Avenue, Hampton Court, and Southview, which are all kind of the area of Five Points that we're talking about today. You're gonna to see some of your nicer homes here. You can see values exceed a million dollars depending on the size of the home. The price per square foot we've seen grow steadily over the last several years due to new construction. So whereas $200 per square foot kind of was the bar at one point, we saw it raised to 225 to 250. And now new construction, we see exceed $250 per square foot in this area. Now that's gonna vary on the home because one thing about Five Points is this area of town is not the oldest part of town, but it is a pretty old part of town. So you've got some, some older homes that often need remodeling. Um, but if you've got a, one that's been totally renovated in this area of town, it's highly desirable. And you know, we see young families here, we see retirees. There's really homes of all varying sizes. You've got maybe under 2,000 square feet with a carriage house in the back to, in some cases, exceeding 5,000. Sidewalks on each side taking this video today at about 11 a.m. and as you can see um, there's cars everywhere because right now we definitely see a lot of uh, new construction and renovations going on in the area. Um, definitely one of Athens most popular streets and what you're about to demonstrate is why. Um, I'm actually heading on to Millage Avenue so we're actually going to drive through the Five Points intersection proper here in a second. So as I come down University I'm getting close to millage and we'll probably have to stop at the stoplight here. But I think it's important to show why people like this. You see, we just came down a sidewalk. A lot of the owners in an area like this want to be walkable. They want to be close to town. And the Five Points area that we're about to go to represents opportunities to do that. You've got restaurants like The Pine, Sakura. You've got Donna Chang's, LRG. You've got a couple bars. Marker 7's a great restaurant that also has a bar, 5 and 10. And straight ahead is the, uh, is the firehouse, which is basically the Five Points intersection. El Barrio is located here on the right, which is sort of Mexican, Mexican cuisine. This uh, fully loaded pizza used to be a Waffle House, and uh, to much controversy, it was closed, and now fully loaded is there doing quite well. But where we sit here at the moment is the Five Points intersection. So to my left, you've got Five Points Bottle, the, the pub, the Royal Peasant, Donna Chang's, uh, various restaurants and venues that people in the area like like to go towards. Straight ahead, past the shell sign of the Golden Pantry, is Marker 7, which offers seafood and is a popular hangout, especially when the weather gets nice for baseball games and in the football season. So this is the intersection of Millage, Lumpkin, and Millage Circle. So if we were to head off to the left, we'd go to another area of Five Points that we'll do a video one day. But what I do want to do is just take you down Lumpkin and sort of show you where Barrow Elementary is because uh, there's a lot about this part of town that people like because of location. Um, you can go to other neighborhoods and get more bang for your buck as far as space goes. But what we can't replicate here is the dirt that the land sits on. This dirt is so close to the university and it's popular for that reason. Is the university is a major driver to our economy. You can be close to events with UGA, close to dining and shopping and things like that. So. The other thing is we have a lot of people that move to town and have a place in their heart for the university. If you went to the University of Georgia, you probably lived in the Five Points area. 
at one point or another and you sort of understand the town and you know that this is an area you want to be so that's just a big part of the driver and five points for the real estate values right here to the right is a place called lumpkin square which are condos that trade for about 170 now two bedroom two baths and the reason for that is they were developed in the 80s but they are right on the 50 yard line i mean here we are we just came off university and we basically entered the start of campus so where i'm about to turn is pinecrest drive which will take you right by the buttsmere athletic building and then it will take you right by Barrow Elementary, which is one of our more popular elementary schools in the area. So that's the Buttsmere, which is where the football team practices and all the athletic departments are. Here is Barrow Elementary, which uh, many children in the neighborhood obviously would go here. Um, you do have private school options, but this is a popular elementary school. And this is what most of Five Points is zoned for. So I just thought I'd end the video on a quick little drive through. Um, as you can see, right behind the school is University Drive that we were on, and you've got grades, basically a preschool option, all the way through fifth grade, located here. Right next to campus, uh, a lot of the UGA athletes often come and visit uh, the students here, which is always fun. And you're right um, by the baseball field. So I know for people who live in the area, one of the things they love to do is to walk to a basketball game, walk to the football game, or walk to the baseball field. So again, this is the Five Points area as a whole, but more specifically, we're talking about University Drive, this area of Five Points. There's the baseball field down the hill. And if you have any interest in this area, it's always very popular, feel free to reach us at 5mrealty.com. That's 5 Market Realty, um, right here in Athens, located on South Millage.